guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's vlog so i haven't vlogged for you guys in a while and i have some things to do today so i just figured why not bring you along with me um during my day it is thursday today so i do have to work but i have some things to do as far as content is concerned and then life because like look at my hands <laughs> like i have two nails missing i need to get myself together so i need to do my nails today i need to post a tiktok um for a collab I need to uh, let me get my iPad. Okay, I think that's pretty much it. Honestly, I have to do my nails. I have to work nine to five, and I have to post that TikTok um, for that collab. And I'm gonna also do a little Fashion Nova um, channel haul for you guys because I bought some things. I filmed a TikTok for it, and a few of you wanted to see the items like on a video, so I'm going to do that as well. And then you know, just regular life stuff. So I'll be doing that and bring you guys along. I woke up this morning at um, 5.30 and went to the gym already, so got that out of the way. Um, it was it was not good. <laughs> like, it was good, but it was not good. I did, whenever I do hip thrust or Bulgarian split squats, I am dying. Like, I literally left there. I wanted to, like, faint and throw up at the same time. It was just, it was not great. Um, but we pull through but yeah so I have to go make breakfast because since we <clears throat> took a while at the gym I haven't eaten yet and I had to log into work for a meeting and now I'm gonna just take a quick break and make something to eat so I'll show you guys that it's just simple I'm gonna make an egg sandwich because that's the quickest thing to do So it is now 12, um, so it's my lunch break. I am currently about to edit a TikTok to post like around 3. Yeah, it's due this week, so I have to post that today because it's already Thursday, so I need to do that. It's for Meshki. Um, I was super hyped when they reached out to me and they wanted to send me some like items for me to shoot a TikTok video and I did that and they liked it, so they wanted to work with me again. They sent me their new... Um, collection that they just dropped kind of like vacay vibes let me show you guys so i have a video here of me posing with the item that they sent me it was a set and two dresses so i'm going to edit that now and then i'm going to hold off and post it like in a couple of hours so if you guys want to see that just head over to my tiktok page or my instagram and then you'll be able to see them there once they're completed, the app that I use to edit my videos for my TikTok and Reels is Splice. I actually got the free version at first, but in order for you to do certain things, um, like there's certain features that I would use that I need, but you have to have the paid version for that. So I pay it monthly. I feel like if you pay it yearly, it might be cheaper, but it's like, I don't know, like 80 bucks up front. So I guess I just, I think it was 80, something like that. Either way, I just pay it monthly because I'm like, oh, I don't know if I'm going to use it all the time so we'll see if i keep that but that's what i use it's called splice it looks like this this one let me not show you the ugly nail <laughs> but it looks like this if this would focus yeah that's the app um again ten dollars a month is what i'm paying for it and it's pretty good like it's really really quick it's on my phone i can edit on the go and it's just super simple to use so i really like it but yeah let me do that and i'll check back with you guys in a bit All right, so I'm almost done editing this TikTok. It took me longer than I thought because if you guys knew 
like the behind the scenes of these things it's just so like it's much more than what you see literally i recorded myself posing with these outfits like for like five six minutes each and then i have to get like a i got like a 20 23 second video from them you know so i have to crop and make sure i like how everything looks so and then i lit everything out here just so i can get a kind of like a intro for the video itself since i just started like posing so it looks something like this i have that i have to add words to it and then i'm just like posing with the outfits so now i just export it from splice and then i go into tiktok to add like my text and everything that's pretty much what i've been doing lately and it works fine let me go watch i watch it first because i like to watch myself like so many times before i even like post it it's kind of ridiculous but gotta do what you gotta do <laughs> the best is when you look at your footage and you're like smiling at yourself because like it's cute uh, it's giving it's giving okay so i finished the tiktok it's edited and saved as a draft. I showed my boyfriend and he said it looks nice because I always ask him for approval. So I can see his vibe if he's like, oh my god, yeah, it's so nice. And I know it's good. If he's like, yeah, it's okay. I know he's lying. So he's not listening to me. I'm in the bathroom right now. I have to cut my nails because I keep biting on them and like twisting them and everything. So I'm just going to cut them real quick. Don't look towards my closet. I have a mess there. I'm just going to use this to cut them down. Either way, I'm going to have to do it later, so I might as well do it now. So yeah, after this, I'm going to go serve some lunch because I'm like starving. And then I'm going to go back to work. So I'm just going to make some tuna. All right, so here it is. I like it a little bit burnt, so I leave it there for a little while. Then I put like a little bit of avocado. The avocados are small, so that's why that was one of the one of the pieces. And I eat it with a rice cake. Right now, I have the wild rice, lightly salted one. I actually really like them. Um, at first, I was like, this is like flavorless, but it's because I got the um, no salt, like salt free one. I didn't really like that one. I prefer the lightly salted one. Still tastes pretty good though. So that's gonna be my lunch for now because it's quick, easy, and tastes really, really good. Guess what time it is right now? It's like seven o'clock. I just logged up for work. So of course, the day that I want to vlog and do stuff, I have to stay late. <sighs> Anyways, let's not even get started with them. But I'm gonna clean up my room. Oh, I haven't showed you guys actually. I switched my room around. Let me show you. So we moved things around like a couple weeks ago. I put my desk in here with the Mac and my my bed is now facing this way. Previously, the headboard was facing, it was like this way. And then I have this here for now because I'm like, we're, you know, deciding on our move situation. We were trying to see if switching the bedroom like this and we made changes in the living room as well, if we can like make do and stay here but it's just not gonna work um this is like where we put the couch there's my boyfriend and we work next to each other because we work from home so our desk are right there and then everything else stays the same um we moved the mirror out here which by the way this is a new mirror because my old one broke um you guys haven't seen things in a while but it literally shattered we were the day we were moving the stuff around um it just fell it was like leaning against here and it just plop on the ground so this is a new one of the same one from ikea and we put it here everything else looks the same the only other difference is um in the closet don't judge me for the mess because this is not me this is not who i am but this is who i am right now i brought the chest in here in order to put the desk right there um we close that door off so we can't go through there anymore which is kind of annoying but we put this in here we can get you know get dressed and i mean shower and everything and then come here and get dressed um again don't mind the mess this is just clothes that i have to do a couple hauls for and stuff and then everything else looks the same but i feel like it's just so like oh everything looks messy 
so it's just not a vibe but the good news is that we actually found an apartment so i am so freaking excited oh my god i'm so excited we were looking around i know that um i did a vlog a couple weeks back maybe a month ago and we were touring some apartments we just didn't really vibe with any of those but we went to this one apartment like two weeks ago i think it was and we were just like wow this one this is the one like this is the one i'm gonna put my camera down because my arm hurts so yeah i'm like super excited and we move in next month so we kind of have to start putting things to sell and like deciding what we're gonna do furniture is looking expensive right now so we're just kind of like where are we gonna get a couch from because the couches are like in the thousands even like Wayfair prices are like ridiculous. I'm like, Wayfair, who do you think you are? Like, you're supposed to be the plug for like, you know, the good stuff at a cheap price. But no. Literally, my bed cost me like $500 when I bought it. And now it's like $1,300. And that's insane. But anyways, we'll figure it out. And of course, I will give you guys like a apartment tour once we get the keys and everything next month. And, you know, vlog the whole experience and everything. It should be fun. I'm excited to buy furniture we decorate it's gonna be a whole different vibe because the cabinets over there are light and like dark countertops everything else it's gonna be like a little more maybe brighter than here because here is like more like a dark color scheme so yeah sorry for the background noise so i'm gonna do a haul for you guys but first i'm gonna take off these nails because look at this as you can see here i have my ipad with the show on because you know we get bored I'm gonna use my drill to kind of like file off most of it and then I'm going to use these little clip things here that I got from Amazon. It's like this with um, these like little cloth things and acetone and just like soak them in there and then once they come up I'm just going to uh, take it off and like file my nails and buff them out. And I'm not gonna do them today. Like I said, I'm not gonna have time. It takes me a while to do it. It's already like 7.44. So they're gonna get done tomorrow. I might just like drag the vlog to tomorrow so you guys can see how I do my nails. Or I might just vlog another day and show you guys. We'll see. Yeah, I got this drill from Amazon. And I got these drill bits also from Amazon. I am not like a nail tech or anything like that, so. I'm not gonna tell you if it's like great or not, but for my purposes, it works fine. So I think they're good. It works pretty well for me. I just put the drill bit in there, just like these, and then I just kind of like pile away. So that's what I'm gonna do now, and then watch some Netflix, all the chicken cooks and everything. Hopefully, it doesn't take too long. Alright guys, so I took a little break and I did like a little stir fry, just brown rice, broccoli, green onions, purple onions, eggs, soy sauce, and like a chicken in there. And I'm just going to eat that right now before I continue with my nails. Hey guys, so I finished doing my nails or taking them off. I don't know if you can see because this camera doesn't focus when it needs to. You can kind of see them. They're pretty much like nothing. Like I have no nails. Disgusting. And they're all super soft and like mushy from my last acrylic that I did. Like, I don't even remember. But I started doing gel X. I've done three sets already. I think I'm doing pretty good. Um, I've gotten better. So, um, tomorrow I'm going to do them. So, I'll carry the vlog onto tomorrow because as you can see I'm in bed no one's doing the trial haul right now I'm tired it's 10 o'clock and I'm trying to go to bed early because since I do get up early in the morning I'm always exhausted like every day I'm exhausted so I'm trying to go to bed like by 10 but usually it's like 11 so we're trying to be better here but yeah so I'm in bed I'm gonna go on my iPad look at some things that I like um, things that I have to get done today, see if I finish everything, and um, what I have to do tomorrow, I have to go to UPS to return some stuff, and I will film 
my me doing my nails and the fashion overhaul tomorrow so you guys can see everything hey guys so today's friday and it's already like 12 40 so i'm almost gonna go back to like work i had a busy morning at work today so that's why i haven't like updated my vlog so i did wake up early today i woke up like around 5 5 10 something like that i went to the gym got a workout in and then came back home um <clears throat> and logged into work i had meetings so i've been kind of busy i took a little break for lunch and i went to ups to drop up some stuff and um now i'm just gonna make something to eat because i'm a little bit hungry so i might make some tuna again or yeah probably that because it's the quickest thing i can do and i only have like 20 minutes um left if i have a lot like into another meeting so today it's just been busy um yesterday i actually posted the tiktok like i mentioned to you guys um for meshki and i sent them the video so that they can you know see it and everything so that was good and that's done so when i get off of work hopefully not too late today because it's friday and no um i'm gonna do my nails and then do the fashion Nova haul for you guys because i need to get that done and all right guys so it is five o'clock well 5 30 and i finished work so you know that's out of the way i'm gonna do the little fashion Nova haul right now for you guys all right so this is the first top that i have it is a silk white top Dude, the lighting here is just not hitting maybe it's the camera so it looks you know plain blah but you can definitely work with this um i kept it because of that because if it was just off of first hand looks you might think like it might look ugly or like big but you can style it very nicely so i got this one super soft the material feels very nice i got it in a size small and I'll have all the links for all this stuff down below for you guys in case you want to, you know, buy it for yourself. I also got this other shirt, but this one, it's a little bit different because it has like slits on the sides like this. So again, you can definitely make this work and make it look nice. Um, this one, the material is more like just a t-shirt, not t-shirt, but like a shirt material. It's not super stiff. But it's not like it's thin for sure it's thin but it doesn't feel bad a little bit long on the sleeves because i'm kind of short this is a size small as well but yeah it goes like this and again you can make this look pop in with like you know a cute outfit and some heels and stuff so here we go so i have this tea Oh, the tee that I was wearing yesterday, the Boys in the Hood tee, is also from Fashion Nova. Um, it was a size small. It's not oversized. It's more so like a fitted, but a little bit loose. I kind of liked it though because it wasn't super loose. Usually I buy like super baggy tees and they just look like very big. With that one, just fit normal. So it was good for a change. But this one's definitely oversized. As you can see, it's huge. It's a size small. And it's like really big. So if you like, like oversized tees... For whatever reason whether it's for the house or to wear it you know like this style of you like then this one's a good one because it's super oversized and the sleeves are kind of long but you know keep in mind i am kind of short so that's why um, it looks like this on me as well all right next we have this hoodie i think i got a size extra large because i want it to be like a dress but as you can see it's a little on the short side like if i were to bend down <laughs> the butt is out so i can't really wear it like by itself i would have to wear something underneath so yeah but i just got this one super oversized extra large like a nude color you know cute maybe i should have gotten like a extra extra large I'm not sure if they have that um for these so i can like it can be a little bit longer but it's fine. I mean, the arms are already like super long on me. So the other one would have been like super huge. Right. So I also got this same hoodie in black. But that one I got more. Oh, Lord. You see? Mm -mm. Like the white, the soft portion 
sheds a little bit, so it's all over my bra and my pants. I'm gonna have to go freaking get a lit roller. Whatever. Um, like I was saying, I got this one in black as well, but the black one I got it in a size small because I wanted to just wear it regularly. <clears throat> so here's a size small for reference, so as you can see, it fits like a normal hoodie. Is my camera crooked? There we go. Fits like a normal hoodie. And then I also got the pants for it, like the joggers that go with it. And I'm gonna throw those on. Obviously, I look like, you know, it's very baggy. That's the goal. Obviously, you don't have to wear it together. You can just wear the pants and then you can just wear the hoodie by itself or you can wear them together however you want. But this is how they look. And they're kind of like tight down here, so they fit fine. I actually like them. Usually joggers look like ugly on me, but these look decent. They're not super big and thick, so they don't make me look like a buffoon. Usually they all look, make me look kind of squared. I'm not saying these are like the best, but they're better than what I've tried before, so. All right, so I also got this tank top. It's like basic tank top. I actually have this one already. I just bought a new one because mine was kind of getting faded and like the little material was like lifting and stuff. So I just got it because I really like them. You can just throw them on with anything. I have a black and a white and I reordered both black and the white because the white also had like the little, I don't know what that's called. But you know when it starts to like get ugly and faded and like the material is just like bad because I've had it for like, I don't know, maybe like two years already. So I just wanted to get some new ones. And then I also got it in this olive color one and then I got it in this um, like mocha color right here so I got four of them because I really like the ones that I already have so I wanted to get more colors just because you know you can never go wrong these are super good and they're like I think they're like 10 bucks thank you Okay, so I also got this other um, tank top in black and in white right here. And as you can see, it's like different than the other one because it has like thicker um, straps where these are like super skinny. Um, it feels really good material as well and it's like nice fitting. So I like it. And I got the white one just because I like wearing crop tops. So. You know, black and white are always like good staples to have, and they're both also in size small. The other ones are also size small, the ones that I just showed you, so these are good ones. All right, so I now only have a couple of pants, so let me go put those on. I got these ribbed shorts just for like in the house type of thing because they're very like kind of like tight and see through ish. So I just got these for me at home. I got them in both this color and in black, but the black ones are dirty because I already, I already put those on the other day. So they're in my hamper right now, but they're very comfortable. All right, so next we have these black flare jeans. Let me put you down so you can see better. So these are like black flare jeans right here. They're a little long on me because you guys know I'm like 5'1". So they're kind of like long, but they fit very nicely. These are a size three actually, and they fit me well. I've lost like a lot of weight so I think my size 5 kind of varies depending on the type of pants that I have but these actually fit me fine they're a little tight in the stomach area so that's why I'm breathing hard <laughs> but yeah I mean they otherwise they fit they fit fine just a little bit pressed over here but I'm kind of bloated right now because I'm on my time so maybe that's why as well but either way they look nice Okay, and last I got these faux leather pants. Obsessed. They look so good. I love the color. The material feels actually quite nice. I really like how it feels. It's not super leathery where like it makes like a bunch of noise. I don't know. I just really, really like how they look. They have like a nice shimmer to them. They're just nice, in my opinion. So I really like these. These are also in a size 3, I believe. Oops. Oh no, these are size small actually. These are size small. They are like skinny at the bottom. A little long on me, but 
it's fine. And yeah, these are cute. I really like these. So that's pretty much it. Um, I got two other things that I showed in my TikTok video. Um, I think it was some green like cargo pants and another pair of like pants, like trousers or like leggings or whatever you want to call them. But those were too long on me and the cargos were a little bit loose um, on the waist right here. So I didn't really love how they looked so I returned them. But I'll link them down below as well in case you guys um, like them. I'm super short so the tan pants were too, too long on me. And even with heels, they would have dragged the floor, so I don't want to deal with that. And the other ones were just too, like, loose right here. Like, you can see that it was a little bit big on me, and I didn't like that look. So, yeah. But everything else was pretty good. Hey guys, so my camera died mid, you know, me doing my nails, but I just went ahead and cut them, filed them down on the sides, and you know, to kind of get them even-ish, and it's a little bit hard just because I don't have like a certain measurements, but I might have to get one of those, I saw it on, on Amazon, just so I can kind of get the same length without having to do a lot of work and like comparisons between each nails, but they look pretty much similar. So after cutting them down, I went ahead and buffed like the top of them so they're not glossy. And then I just painted them with this gel um, color. It's like a gray. And it's from Beatles. I'll link the nail stuff that I use down below as well. But this is how they come out. They look super natural and they look super nice. It took me a while, but they actually always come out super nice. Here is my other hand. This one had a little mishap right here, but it's all good. We just pretend like it's not there but you see this is my fourth set and they last me like about two weeks whenever i do them um of course as i get better with the prep and everything they will last longer hopefully but here they are but yeah i'm gonna go to sleep because i'm tired it's already 12 12 24 and it's been a long day it took me like two hours to do my nails i was watching raising canaan while i was doing them and then yeah so anyways i'm gonna end the vlog here so thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed i'll have all the links down below for everything that i use for my nails all the fashion nova stuff so make sure to check it out this is not sponsored this is just me showing you guys what i got so anyways yeah i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog and i'll catch you in my next one bye